Hi fam, you know when you see me this way, you know it's giddy way time. So guys, today we'll be doing a very unique style. You must have seen it before, but today we're going to be doing it in a different way, the giddy way, you get it. So if you are a new subscriber, welcome to my YouTube. And if you are old, thank you for always coming around. And please, always practice. If you want to be like giddy, you need to practice like giddy. You get it? So guys, all right, so guys, let me assume this is my client and she wants to sleep for a party. She gave me a length. She gave me three layer gilly. One, two, three. You know this party guest and you know how we check our length. If you go meet a client, first thing you do is to check the length of the gilly. So now see, you can see this is length 75. This is length 75. Uh, so what we we'll do now, maybe she asked me to do a very unique style. So what I'll do, I'm going to be tying a gilly with side knot, meaning I need a V. So I'll just assume that this is up to 90 so that I can share properly. You fold 50-50, I'm going to be getting a 30-70 so that I can do my gilly properly. You fold 50-50, then you go again. See this way is 25, 25 now. Then how many am I going to add to make it 30? We'll just be doing five. So it's like this. So from here, you add your five. Get. So now you start wondering, will this be enough? If you are not sure, you make it 40. Get. Then, repeat from the 40 this way. So please guys, from the 40, you make your things okay now we'll go this way please we are slaying our clients ahead now let me teach you something now if i want the knots now see the knots probably will be this side if if i want it to be the other side that means how my shell should be from this side it should be from the okay so this is okay this is my right hand it will be at the right hand so but since I want it to be the normal way. I'll be doing it the left hand side. So what we'll do like this. Okay, please be handy. Okay. Please always arrange, not being a haste. And uh, nobody's pushing you. Always arrange. So you see? Very neat. And another thing I should let you know, fabric of gilly matters a lot when you tie. Most times, the way this split are coming out of your legs, if it's not a good fabric, you get, if it's not a good fabric, it might not come out that way. I don't know if you get me. I don't know. But try to make a point. So we'll come to the back, we'll come to the back, then we'll share. Get so shape. This one, short one, all the way. So you arrange it to be down. Now see what you do. Once you're here now, you drag it. You put your hand here like this. So you try to remove her toys. Please remove your toys. Please go to the front and say, go to the front, please. Remove her toys. Then you tell her to hold this. Hold it very firm. See. Now you have to be directing your client so that your video will come out when they should place her head here. Okay, so you can see it's still very firm. Some people want it very firm, you know, we don't tie. So it has to be very, very firm. And you know the way we always do our V. I tell you when you're with clients, you don't count. But since this is teaching, I can count one, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm making six splits. Okay, so make it six splits. One, two, three, four. So please make sure your pleats is neat. So one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, now. If it was normal view, we would have made seven, seven pleats, then we tie, you get. But now, since I'm trying to tie it, 
what we do see you push it back out a little you push it this way so that she now will have to hold here you see when i was making my v i tried to make it firm and she's holding here i quickly collect this on from her just make a few pleats now you see so, she, so follow this one she follow this up now what you do you try to put her hands here also so you see this one now we have to share it now we can come like this this one might be too long to come like this so we do bring it small make it smaller we just take from the side so you go over it now see make sure this one is straight then you drag it's tight she will let you know how is it tight right it's tight right okay now see when you get, when you feel it's very firm now you don't just leave this thing this way because this is one of the beauty of the game so make sure showing well nice and arranged you get so if you come to the back and tie it again please come get this come get this one see this they tie the second time Now, if it is too small for you to tie, what you just do, if it is too small for you to tie, what you just do, you take it this way, you roll it, then pin. Okay? So you twist if you know you can't tie and it's too small for you to tie. Then when you twist it, you pin it, make sure when you pin, it comes back up so that it will hold it. You take this other one or two. We do the same. So you get now come back here. Let's come and check. Take a look. Okay, so now what do we have? We have it like this now. Normally with this time, you have it like this now. Yeah. Okay, what I'll do, I'll pin you down. Please, you need to learn how to pin. Here also, I pin it down. Okay, it's firm, so no need for that. No need for that. Okay, now you see the way this stuff is now. This tie can actually produce like five different styles for you. Now, it can be the type of an unconventional fussy. And this, if you arrange this well, it could give you a style. I'm just showing you, but I'll be tying one. But I'm giving you an idea. Do it like this to give you a style. <clears throat> then you can decide to pleat it one after the other. Look at this another style. Also, this is another style. Also, why you pleat everything here? Then you meet. Try to arrange it properly. So you see, I said there's another style on the toe, but the one we're tying today, the one we're tying today, it's we're gonna be for hmm? We're gonna be for it. See, instead of making your plate like this, we're making it this way. So, so now this is it. So what we we'll do now? I don't care. It's normally your thing. So like I was saying, you know there are a lot of styles you can do with this. You can just decide to pleat knit round, knit round here, knit round here. So but for this, instead of picking this way, you pick it straight. Now watch. Make it flat. Look at. Okay. Make it very flat. You see how it is a bit. Then you fold another one from the back. Flat again. You get now. Do not try this at home. My pin band is not with me today, so do not try it at home. You pin from the back. Look at it comes out. It comes out. Then we take it backward again. It's holding this total. So 
what I'll do, I'll peel the egg out so. Look at it, it comes out. Take it out, okay? Do the same thing here. Now, we have to arrange it properly. Watch. Now, one funny thing is the about this tie. One funny thing about this tie is when you're doing your own, your shape might be different, but it should be round. Might be doing your own now, you might not get it this way, but it should be flat and round. So I don't decide. Let me unify the sides, meet it. So we'll do the same thing not so yet. Just hold. Now here, yeah, I think I have a lot of pleats, so I can make this one up to tail. So get so. Make sure you do it to the down, pat. Now see? Pin it also. See, you see it comes out. Come on, please come closer. Thank it you. comes out. Okay. So. So it goes in again. Okay, so now how do we join it together here? We down this side, we down this side. So I'm draining both sides together. So now, how to make it? There you go. I'm trying to do, I'm trying to give it a nice shape. Because one thing is for your baby to be fine, another thing is for it to have a shape. So start dressing it to have a very nice shape. A very unique and unconventional size. So, you know them fit to pin you pin it anyway I think it's necessary for us to pin pin it because time like this does not have okay this is the basic this is it this is it so just come do your thing and this is it. Now I know you'll be wondering how the back would look. So now what you do, you be careful that you rub and you pin just food. You fold. If the person wants a head to show, get and the person does not so why right for this we just put it inside 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 and you pin 
can get so it gives us a very secure piece then you just pin this one here yeah? then we'll go forward okay just go go forward okay so guys okay, let's go forward so guys you can see how it is it's a fun conventional style so i will be expecting you guys to try it out So I wanted to see, okay, so now the issue is you can try this out, you can try any style out, or you might even tie these knots and decide to do farm with this side and do round with this side. So this is style and this is also a challenge for me to you to explore, you understand? So be creative, do something new. And I'll be dropping uh, a telegram link. I'm dropping a telegram link 